Welcome to Streets of the U.S. Today, I will be in Colorado and I will be discussing the Sons of Silence Motorcycle Club. The Sons of Silence Motorcycle Club was started in Colorado in 1966. They have several chapters all over the country and overseas. This motorcycle club has been involved in multiple crimes over the years. In 1993, a Sons of Silence member named Daryl Klein was killed at a bar in Colorado Springs. Eugene Bayless shot the bar up with an AK-47. He killed two people and wounded five. Eugene was actually acquitted of the murders. Eugene got acquitted claiming self-defense Jurors actually acquitted him of all charges in 1995, but he was immediately held on federal weapons charges. It later came out that he went inside the bar looking for somebody who insulted him earlier. He returned with a semi-automatic rifle, a handgun, and four grenades before he started shooting. Eugene was actually in a shootout with members of the Sons of Silence Motorcycle Club. And during the shooting, he was also wounded. In 2018, Eugene Bayless was in a shootout with two Bureau of Land Management police officers where he was killed near Grand Junction, Colorado. In 2013, three members of the Sons of Silence were arrested in Kansas City, Missouri. The police found meth, marijuana, and 10 guns inside the gang's home. In 2019, a Sons of Silence enforcer was arrested in Fargo, North Dakota. He admitted to killing a woman four years earlier on the Spirit Lake Nation. Billy Joe Herman, got life in prison for committing the murder. He strangled the female and put her in the trunk of his car with the help of his then wife, Crystal Johnson. The two drove the female to a bridge, beat the female with a shovel and dumped her into a river. She was wrapped in a tarp and they used cinder blocks to weigh it down. Her body was located in February of 2016. Johnson told the police about the crime her and her ex-husband had committed. She was hoping to get immunity for her part in the crime, but ended up getting 20 years in prison. In 2021, a Sons of Silence member got 10 months in federal prison for being a felon in possession of a weapon. Justin Carlson, and other members of the Sons of Silence confronted a motorcyclist from another club. The motorcyclist was an off-duty police officer. During the confrontation, the off-duty police officer was told that he couldn't wear one of the patches that was on his motorcycle jacket. This confrontation led law enforcement to investigate the Sons of Silence. And that investigation led to Carson having his home searched and police found weapons and firearms. The ATF got involved and Carson was federally charged. In 2022, a high ranking member of the Sons of Silence got 10 years in prison. Seaburn John Henry from Colorado Springs had a firearm, which was prohibited for him to have. He also had meth, which he was distributing. The police found a total of 228 grams of meth. If you like this story, please like, subscribe, and comment on the channel. Thank you.